I've been heartbroken for maybe 25 years knowing what I know about the animal agriculture industry and what's been happening, but in this particular moment, watching so many people stay at home and say that they're staying home because they want to care for the vulnerable. While that is the most beautiful thing, I'm struggling with the, the fact that if we really care about the vulnerable people, then we would be concerned about the fact that over two million people die a year of hunger. I know it's a complicated system that we've built, but I think that the only thing that stands in our way is corporate greed. That's it. The hospitals are run by corporations, so they're not telling everyone how to get well. You want people to get well? Change their diet. Simple. You want the earth to heal so our children can have a future, so that we can have a future? Change your diet. Whatever you believe this is about, the answer is always change your diet. So it's so simple because everything will heal. We've seen the benefits of what's happened in the last month or two with the birds and the air and the cars, you know, being gone. Like we see what's happening, how much just that little difference of everything being quiet has made the earth, Mama Earth is saying thank you, right? We feel that. Imagine if we can shut down for this, what if we shut down just for a second and think about how to restructure everything? If everyone just uses plants as their medicine, as their food, their, their bodies will heal, the earth will heal, and we will no longer have these pandemics to worry about. We will no longer have a future to worry about. All those people who have diabetes and who have cancer and have heart disease, the answer is on their plate. It's the thing you do three times a day. And the really cool thing is it's delicious. When you eat healthy plant-based food, I'm a food snob. I don't want to eat it if it isn't delicious. So there's no sacrifice. It is delicious. There's no deprivation. It's just yumminess and you feel good. And feeling good is contagious. And when you feel good, all that comes out of you is goodness. So you don't have this sort of aggressive, angry population of people walking around really scared and upset and mean. I'm, I'm interested in a kind world where we all eat kindly, responsibly, compassionately, thoughtfully. You know, all you have to do is feed people this delicious food. Grab any meat eater off the street and feed them this food and I dare them not to love it. <laughs> They're going to say what they say at every party I have. If I could eat this way all the time, I would. Guess what you can? You can, so do it.